Hello, this is the Acrolic Rocksman here. Today I'm going to do a tier list on Team Fortress 2 Classic Maps. Two things to note is that the maps here are all from the official standard servers. Another thing is that despite sharing the majority of the maps with normal TF2, TF2C does not have the same weapons, thus it has its own maps either made from the Steam Workshop or the, or the developers themselves. Therefore, maps will have a different experience compared to casual TF2. Want to make your own tier list? The link will be in the description. If you like this, please show your appreciation in the comments or leave a like. And with that, let's get into the tier list. Right, so first off, we start with Pipeline. It's, it's an alright map. Like, I've played it a couple times and multi stage. It's alright, it's not like high tower level, high tower is pretty cool, so it's going in here. Fast lane. Um another alright map. Um bit long but that's expected of high CP and I like the aesthetic. Um like deserty sort of thing, so it's decent. It's decent. I forgot to add to pipelines that I love the aesthetic on pipeline too, like night sort of thing. Yeah. Uh, five CP gorge. Um. Ugh. Nothing. I don't hate it. I don't hate it. It's just I can't think of anything to, that makes it. You know. Decent. Um, it's going in the middle. Ring of Badlands. Oof. Um, yeah, it's like most arena maps. They're just well, actually all arena maps. It the rounds are always short, and it's not really iconic. It's not really stand out. So, yeah. Arena Flask, however, um, four teams makes it pretty unique. Um, it's got this symmetry thing, plus there's piss team or yellow team. Like, but in TF2C we like to call it piss team, and it's become like a meme. Um, so, yeah, definitely. Arena Granary. I haven't really played this map much. much um, it's same as like bad light and it's not really outstanding, it's just like eh. Yeah. It's just Yeah. Arena Lumber Yard decent arena map. It's like like I wouldn't say I can't think of like tactically what or strategic uh, strategically how valuable it is, but it is a decent map, like um, yeah, it's going in there. Plus, I like the aesthetic. Um, Arena Nucleus. I do not like this map. Like, I do not like Nucleus at all. Um, so, yeah. Ravine. Eh. Yeah. It's, a uh, it's another alright map. Um, it's a, it's got its own thing, like, yeah, it it's there. It's there. Um Arena Sawmill. Uh again, nothing too outstanding, it's nothing special. Um but it's nothing bad about it. Um definitely going there. R Arena well, um it's got water. It's got water. Um Yeah. <laughs> So yeah, um, Barn Blitz, Payload's probably one of my favourite uh, game modes, um, um, I like the Lanford Plus, I like the Journey sort of thing, it's not, it's not bad, um, it's got the snow aesthetic and, um,
like going out of spawns, not like it's not going to be spawn camped. Actually, that's another thing I should add, like whether the maps are spawn campable or not, or are strategic. It's like most of these maps are fairly sound, like in terms of strategy, there's nothing outstanding about it or anything. Um, I'd say it, I'd say it's decent. Uh, Cold Front, uh, one of my personal favourites. Um, again, mostly because of snow. Um, sentry position, like you know, sentry position is pretty cool. Um, last point is uh, well, the last points uh, are pretty pretty defendable. Um, midpoint is fairly open. It's a fairly open map. It's not closed, so there are sniper sight lines. Um, yeah, it's a decent map. Um, CP Amaranth for Amaranth. Um, this is one of my favourite maps. I love it to bits. Um, it's got it's it's got like uh, similar to Gorge, like CP Gorge, or yeah. Thing about this map is that I've never seen it been spawn camped at all. I don't think there's been spawn camp thing happening ever. Um, the second point's fairly hard to defend, same as the first one, if you're on red, but it can be done. It's uh, not the most uh, sound like pathways, like it goes a bit, and a plus is a train. But overall, like the sniper sight lines are alright. It's fairly open, it's not closed, and can't be spawn camped at all. And the sentry area is alright. So, yeah, personal opinion, but yeah. Uh, CP Badlands. I, I like the mountain bits. Um. Midpoint's alright, and last point, yeah, last point's pretty cool. Sometimes you can get back to capped, like, so I'd say decent. CP De Groot, um, yeah, it's the only medieval mode map on TF2C and normal TF2. Um, it's Recently, it's been removed from the official map, um, official standard maps, so can't really play for it anymore. But from memory, um, it's kind of lacking with that the demo night, and it needs more content, uh, like medieval mode as a whole. Um, so it's going here. CP Egypt, great map, great map, um, like, it's a multi-stage map, and, um, first round's alright, like, first bit, like, you can hold it, plus, you won't get spawn camped, um, it's pretty good if you, like, try hard in a bit, plus, space for friendlies too. If you're into that, um, it's going, it's going in decent. It's going in decent. Boundary. Um, the in the industrial look um, is alright. It's a pretty good map. Like, yeah, it's there's nothing like that stands out to me or. Like either way, good or bad. So it's going in here. Um, CP freight. Um, same same as foundry. Nothing outstanding about it except the water bit. Like there's, yeah, it's pretty open. Like same as foundry. Uh, there's some flank routes that aren't really the best, but yeah. So it's going in here. CP Furnace Creek. Um, 
Ooh. It's it's like gravel pit, but like doesn't really appeal to me that much. Like, um, yeah, it's, it's going in here. Sorry. Um, CP Gorge. Um, decent map. Like, I like it. It's, it's can get repetitive, but it is alright. Um, CP Granary, um, again, another fire CP map, nothing outstanding about it, um, except for that little route where it's like in a tunnel thing, um, yeah, it, it's going in here, but it's like above Arena Granary, um, CP Golly Rush, um, this is actually a fairly good map um yeah i i can't think of anything like the forts this but i know that's good and yeah it, it can be, get a bit long but sometimes long games are fun games um it, it it's going in here uh, CP Junction, worst map ever. Like, ugh, literal hell, literal hell. N no, no argument. No, like, there's multiple reasons why it's a bad map. Like, it's so closed off, and, it, and it's not even fun. Like, like, ugh. Mount. All right. Mo moving on. Moving on. Uh, CP Mountain Lab, decent map, decent map. I like the uh, jungle aesthetic. Um, I like the routes that it takes. It's not really cramped. It's fairly open, and uh, it's defendable. And you can also have your own positions for both teams. So definitely decent, definitely decent. CP Powerhouse. Oh my goodness. Um, yeah. It's definitely going in here because I played a round and it was the most intense round of my life. I've never had an experience like that on other maps. It's uh, sniper silence are all right, like they're good. Engineer spots are good. It's pretty open. There's some r routes. There's multiple routes. Um, you can get a little bit spawn camped there. So, but it is. It is good overall. Uh, CP title. Um, I don't like this map. But it's not like literal how it's just like doesn't really ap appeal to me that much. Um, it's just uh, it's just bland to be honest. It's nothing outstanding about it. It's just um, CP well. Um, this one's a pretty good map. This one's a pretty good map in TF2C. Um, it's not like over here, but because it's it's like from the 2009 era. It's got like some features in it. For example, um, like unlike the other five CP maps, it uh, it's got like this countdown thing. Like you have with normal payload and in this gate, so yeah, it's definitely going. I'd say it's going here. Um, CP Yukon. Um, hmm. I don't hate it. I don't hate it, but I don't exactly like it. It's it's decent. It's decent. Like like it's in the okay. I can play this area. Um, CTF two four, um, repetitive. That's all there is about it. The only good thing is that you can, like, I can do a little gimmick of mine where I can make a sentry nest in the enemy team. So, yeah, yeah, it's going in here. CTF Casper. Again, another map that I really hate. It just 
it's like every single round, one team is either really good and the other is really bad. And it's just like, it's interchangeable. Like, it can be happen to red or blue. And usually blue, for example, let's take an example that red is really good. Like, red has the advantage and blue doesn't. It's literal hell for blue team. Like, red team will just dominate all, every time. And, yeah. Even if you team scramble, it still sucks. It's literal hell. TTF double cross. It's basically better to fort. There's... Um, but you can't really build a sentry in the intel. But, yeah. it It's better than two fort. A CTF landfall. Another good CTF map. Um, it's definitely up there in my personal list. Um, I like you can walk around it, like that that sort of thing. Plus, you can do some friendly stuff too. Um, CTF sawmill. Uh, it it's yeah, it's there. It's not exactly the best. It's not like. Um, turbine. Uh, same with sawmill. It's just like, eh. Don't. It's not really outstanding. Um, can't think of anything good about it. Can't think of anything bad. Um, CTF well, decent. It's decent. Um, a thing about CTF well is that, um. It is defendable, it is defendable, like, it is, you, um, another thing is that you can go on, I'm not sure if you can see, but you can go on these little parts uh, at the top and you can, as a demo, and you can stick your trap, your intel from there, which is, it is fun, it is kind of fun, um, but yeah, it's going decent. Uh, Dom Hydro. I don't like Hydro at all, but, um, Domination Hydro is just slightly better than TC Hydro in my opinion. Um, it's it's another four team map, but it's like, yeah, it's it's going in here. Dom Oil Canyon, um, it's not really outstanding, it is another Domination map where you go to like, we have to capture points and... The points have to go to 100. Um, it's not really outstanding. It is. It does. Um, how should I say? Keep you busy. It keeps you busy. Like you're constantly going from one control point to another, fighting over. So it's better than hydro to say because hydro, it's unbalanced. Like for map, for the map, like. Usually red team will have a good defensible position, but green won't. But on Dom on your can with just two teams, it's it's decent. It's decent. Um, cough badlands. I do not like cough maps at all. Um, like it's one of my least favorite game modes. But I'm not gonna hate on it. Like it's not like literal hell. None. I don't think any of the cough maps here are literal hell. It's just like, please no. Um, but Badlands is, Badlands is up here. Um, so is Coughed half as a fence, mainly because of the ghosts. Um, doesn't matter whether you're on Halloween or Screen Fortress, you can play this any time on TFTC. Um, Coughed half is, is, uh, it's please no. I, I don't really like it, like, like there's some... Maps where the symmetry works really well, and some where it doesn't. And Koth Harvest to me is one of the ones that doesn't work well. Um, Koth King is a pretty good uh, King of the Hill map. I do like it a lot. It's I consider it the best Koth map. Um, yeah, it, it's going in decent. It's going in decent. Um, Koth Lakeside, it's 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 in the middle. It's in the middle. Um, cough nucleus is 
again, I don't like Nucleus, it's definitely going in here. Off Sawmill, again. Sawmill is one of those maps, it's just like, regardless of whichever mode it is, it's just like in the middle. Um, Arena Off Blast is a good arena map, I love it. Um, like, it has, you can go, it's like multiple floors you can fight over and um, there's also places where you can like get health, get ammo. Um, there's also some funny places. Sometimes we can fall over the edge. Sometimes you can stay on the edge by walking up, by pressing the W key and facing the wall. And yeah, uh, yes, it's a nest here. Um, Palo Badwater. I love Palo maps. If I haven't said that already, um, um, Battle was like fairly o iconic. Um, it's not like the best payload map, but it's going in decent. It's going in decent. Same with a uh, Frontier. Frontier has some funny like engineer spots. Like you can place funny teleporters. You can place funny sentries. Um, it's one of my favourites, so it's definitely going in here. Um, very biased. Um, but most tier maps are like tier list. Sorry, um, Gold Rush. It's literally the dust bowl of payloads. Um, I I no, it it's going down. Same with Hoodoo. Hoodoo's just like actually the only good part about Gold Rush is the last um. This last uh, round, I I don't mind that. Oh, that one's pretty good actually. Um, but still, and please no. Same with Fudu. Um, High Tower, pretty good map. Pretty good map. Um, it is repetitive, but like it's not like boring repetitive. It's always like there's always something to do. It's it's going in decent. Um, Found a Mountain, classic map. It's not like outstanding, it's not like the best map in the game, but it is a decent map and it's nostalgic. So it's fairly old. Um yeah, it's going it's going here. Um upward, same thing as Fun Mountain. It's it's a classic. Um Actually I'll, I'll put it up here because of the funny sentry spots like in, and tele spots really. Um can get spawn cameras, but it's not that inconvenient. Um, Doomsday. I know some people like Doomsday because it's like a unique game mode. It doesn't really, really appeal to me. Um, it for me it just gets repetitive and boring. Like, yeah, it's it's going in here. Um, CP Steel. Um, it can be fun. Like, it's n I don't hate it. Um, it can get a bit boring, but it can be really fun. It, like, especially if you try to cap it at the very start, like cap the middle. Um, yeah, the best part is when you actually succeed. Um, at capturing the middle. Um, so actually, it's going up here. Um, TC Hydro, um, not, mm, I don't like it, it's, it's worse than Dom Hydro, like, it, it, like, it's a good idea, like, territorial control, it's an interesting idea, but Hydro is just not the map for it. Um, Dust Bowl. I know some people hate it because it's easily spawn camp, but it can be fun. It's one of those classic nostalgic maps. And, uh, um, CP Dust Bowl. As I said, it's, yeah. I'm not sure where to put it, really. Like, it can be good, but it can be, like, pain. Last point can be a tense, like defending it and attacking it. So it's going in here. It's not 
awful. It's not like that can be literal hell sometimes, but not all the time. Um, CP Gravel Pit, better than Furnace Creek. I'll give it that. Um, it's definitely going in here. It's definitely going in here. Um, Cough Fire Duct. Um, yeah, it it's it's all right. It's not like overly. It's, it's not outstanding. Um, yeah, VIP Bad Water Vote. Oh my goodness, best 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 VIP map ever. Um. Harbo comes in second, but it's definitely going in here. I love VRP, and they're they're really well designed. Um, mine side is air, yeah, like it's not it's not boring, it's not repetitive. Um, can be a bit annoying with the uh, when you have like a bad civilian, like because sometimes because in this particular map, um. You have to, as a civilian, you have to pick up the intel and bring it to, like, point. And sometimes the civilian forgets to pick up the intel and, yeah, it can leave your game screwed if, you, if that happens. Um, but it's going in here. Um, train yard, it's, it's going in here, like. Mainly because as soon as the civilian dies, that all the entire game ends. That part just it can get old very quickly. Um, it's very fast paced. Like you gotta cap the point quick, but you also gotta not die, and can take a while. Um, arena watchtower, another good arena map. Another good arena map. Um. I love the height of it, I love that it's good for soldiers, it's good for demo, um, it, it's good for all classes, like, spy, like, even, could do some damage, so, it, it, but it's not like here, I don't think it's gonna belong here, but it definitely belongs here, um, last one, Nightfall, um, it's meh. It's not the worst, but it doesn't really stand out to me. It's not really memorable. Um, and yeah, that's it. That's the uh, that's my opinion on every map in TFTC officially. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, sorry if I stutter a bit. Um, that's just the way I speak. Um, I don't really have the best voice and I haven't really developed it. Um, but hopefully, yeah, you like this sort of stuff. You, um, there is the map in, in the, the t um, sorry, the TMA uh, link in the description. I will add that. Um, I actually had to create this all by myself. Like I couldn't find anything like it, so I had to do it all by myself. So please show your appreciation if you like it in in the comments or leave a like or subscribe. Um, thank you. Um, thank you for watching this. Um.